a celebration of faith and art, the splendor of the adoration of the Magi by Justice of Ghent. Justice of Ghent's The Adoration of the Magi is a magnificent artwork that depicts one of the most revered scenes in Christian history. Painted around 1475, this masterpiece is based on the Gospel of St. Matthew, where three Magi from the East visit the newborn Christ child and offer him gifts of gold, frankincense, and myrrh. The painting is set on a grand porch, where the three Magi, each representing a different age and region, have arrived to worship the Christ child. The Virgin Mary, dressed in a royal blue gown and a white mantle, sits on a red-covered bed, symbolizing her role as the Bride of Christ. She tenderly holds her child and presents him to the oldest king, who kneels in adoration, offering his gift of gold. The other two kings, one middle-aged and one young, wait patiently to approach the Christ child. Joseph, Christ's earthly father, stands behind Mary, gesturing with his left hand to welcome the visitors and to introduce them to the Holy Family. The painting is rich in details that convey deeper religious meanings and references. The snuffed-out candle on the bedside table suggests that Christ is the true light of the world. The bread and wine on the table in the foreground are Eucharistic symbols, recalling Christ's Last Supper and his sacrifice on the cross. The gold vessel offered by the African king is decorated with a pelican feeding its young with its own blood, a symbol of Christ's love and redemption for humanity. The crystal orb offered by the middle-aged king is symbolic of the world and of Christ's role as the savior of the world. The painting is also remarkable for its use of distemper, a water-based medium, on canvas, which is very rare for this period. The artist was active both in his native Ghent, in modern Belgium, and at the refined court of Urbino in Italy, where he was influenced by the Italian Renaissance. The painting reflects the increasing presence and diversity of black individuals in Western Europe, but also raises the question of whether the three black figures in the composition were based on a single model or on an idealized type. The Adoration of the Magi is a splendid piece that showcases the artist's skill and creativity in portraying a sacred event with realism and symbolism. It invites the viewers to witness and participate in the celebration of faith and art.